Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have created this look inspired by Sonam Kapoor's Wedding Mandi look. She had a very flawless base, pair of or false lashes and a pink lip. She just flaunted this look very effortlessly. If you want to know how I created this look then do please keep on watching. Starting off with foundation, I am dotting my foundation on my center part of my face and then buffing it using a kabuki buffing brush. Then for my concealer, I'm using a Wet n Wild concealer. Uh, I'm going to list all the products out in my description, so please check it out. So I'm just applying that also as my eyeshadow base and around my mouth on my pigmentation wherever I want to apply. I'm just applying it there and I'm blending it using an angular blending brush. Next to highlight, I'm applying a lighter shade of concealer once again on my under eyes and also on the center points of my face and blending it out using the same angular blending brush. I have baked my face using my loose powder for some reason I lost that footage but for the rest of the face I'm setting it with my compact powder. I'm going to fill in my brows now. I noticed Sonam Kapoor's eyebrows were very thick so I'm trying to achieve that using my APH deep brow pomade. And for her eye makeup it was a very simple smoky eye look. So for the crease I'm applying a transition brown onto my crease and then to deep that color I'm going to uh, apply a dark brown eyeshadow onto the crease. She had like a pale golden eyeshadow on her eye space. So I'm going to apply a pale golden eyeshadow using a flat brush on both of my eyelids. And I'm going to take the same blending brush. I'm going to apply that brown eyeshadow onto that outer corner just before the outer corner let's say that. I also noticed that she had black eyeshadow on the very outer edge of her eyes. So I'm just placing black eyeshadow using a pencil brush first and then I'm buffing that out into smoky eye using a blending brush. Moving on, I'm going to apply a liner, black jet black eyeliner. And she also had a very precise wing. So I'm going to do that. Now I'm going to apply a black coal on only on my waterline because she didn't have any other black drama going on on the lower lash line or so. So I'm just applying it on the waterline but for the lower lash line I'm going to apply a dark brown instead of black. And then I'm going to apply lots of mascara and then off camera I'm going to apply my falsies and I'll be right back. Of face makeup now I'm going to use a very precise brush to contour my nose because I noticed that she didn't have a lot of contour going on on her cheekbones or something so I'm just going to take blush instead of contour I'm gonna apply lots of blush because she had rosy cheek going on so I apply lots of blush and then highlighting For my lips, I'm going to apply a nude rose lip liner first and then followed by a same shade of lipstick. That's it for my look you guys. I hope you all enjoyed this. If you really did then do like, comment and subscribe to my channel. Follow me on my Instagram for more updates. I'll see you all soon in my next video. Bye.